Skating coach Joel Savory has made it his mission to encourage minority children to lace up their skates and hit the ice. Joel is coach on both the national and international level, and he helped his brother become a junior national champion. But one of his biggest accomplishments starting the Diversify the Ice Foundation right here in our area to help introduce the sport to underprivileged children. Fox photojournalist Jesse Burkett Hall shows us how. So I started ice skating uh, through a free ticket that I got from school as well in school. I was really excited to go my first time. I just tried whatever I saw people do on TV. A woman came over and said, you know, how long you been doing this? She was very surprised. That was my first time skating, so she asked if she could coach me. I was born and raised in Miami, which makes the story even more interesting. Nobody really understood why I wanted to ice skate. There were so many other things that you could do that was considered cool for minority kids like me, like basketball and football. I remember one of the kids told me in class, um, you know, black people don't ice skate. And, you know, that really shut me down a little bit. I started to try to transition from skating competitively to teaching my younger brother. My brother Joel used to be a figure skater. I wanted to start skating, but my mom wouldn't let me. Um, my younger brother, he actually ended up going to the Junior National Championships and winning the Junior Nationals as well. My love was to see more kids do well um, and to get more minorities to be a part of it um, because I knew how difficult it was for me to even pay for ice skating. I really wanted to get more opportunities for other people to learn how to skate that may not have those opportunities as well. So that's why I decided to start the Diversify Ice Foundation. You get to feel free and you get to do what you want to do when you want to do it and it's fun. My name is Caitlin Sonda. The good thing is you get to you learn lessons from it, so like you fall and then you get back up. And in first place, I have Caitlin Saunders. Woo! Caitlin. My goal is to reach the Olympics when I get older. So. Well, my new book is um, I'm really excited that it just dropped. It's called Why Black and Brown Kids Don't Ice Skate. Part of my autobiography as well. Um, some of the hardships and some of the difficulties that I found with race in ice skating. And from there, I kind of go into some of the solutions that could be put in place that's going to help revitalize the sport as a whole. And I really want to make skating cool and fun so that anyone can feel confident in saying that they are an ice skater no matter what your background is. How cool is that? Makes me want to get on the ice. <laughs> on January 11th, the Diversify Ice With Foundation <laughs> is holding a fundraiser on ice at the Veterans Plaza in Silver Spring. And I'm you sure know what I'm talking about, the penguins? Yes, I do. Thank you. No, I'm just kidding. You got, yeah, wait till you see my triple axle, <laughs> <Yeah>. Angela. <laughs> see the aftermath. 